name's Tom Cullen and I'm an actor. The way I got into the industry is a, is a, is a, is a kind of roundabout way. I always wanted to be an actor. Ever since I was, I was a little kid, I, I, can, I can remember, you know, putting on plays. I think we all did. But, but, you know, I used to wake up early and, and dress up and do little plays before my parents would get up. And so it was something that I knew always existed inside me. Um, but it took me a long time to, to actually do it. So I, I grew up with, with friends who acting wasn't really, you know, it, what, what just wasn't part of our vocabulary. Um, so it took me a lot of confidence and it took a lot of time for me to, to get to a point where, where I felt that I, I could go to a drama school and apply. But I, also, I, I never had the kind of belief that I was ever worth doing that. Um, both, both my parents are writers, but, but I think there's something that has to come from inside you to, to build up that, that, that first kind of initial you know, leap into doing something. And, um, and it took me a long time to, 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 to build that up. Um, and you, I don't think you can really rush that. So I went to drama school uh, when I was 22, and I went to the Royal Welsh College of Musical Drama, which is in, in Cardiff in Wales. Our drama school was great because there was, there was only 20 of us in there. And out of the 20, because um, you do a showcase, which is a kind of, you stand up for two and a half minutes, and it's, it's a bit like a cattle market, it's not, it's not very nice. Um, and you kind of like try and sell yourself, essentially, as, as an actor. And, and all, luckily all 20 of us were signed by the time that we graduated. So I got, I got, I got picked up about halfway through my third year. And I had quite a few offers on um, from other agents, other bigger agents than the agent I'm, I'm currently with, who is, who is a fantastic, absolutely amazing agent. But the reason I chose them was because we had a very clear relationship and I, I knew that they believed in, in me as an actor and they made effort in me. And, and though other agents could promise me this and promise me that and promise me this and promise me that, I kind of felt that the relationship was going to be something that was much more important. And I, I, I think I, I think I, I, I think I made a very good choice because we we work together brilliantly, um, and I know that she's always fighting my corner, and I, I will always stay with her. I think for for as long as my career lasts. My first year out was tough, and I wasn't getting that many auditions. So I formed my own theatre company. I wrote my own plays. I, I directed my own shows, and you self-generate, and you learn, and, and you constantly try and evolve and push yourself, um, and then things start happening because because you're working your balls off, and I think that's that's incredibly attractive and also incredibly rewarding. I think one of the most satisfying jobs I've ever had as an actor, as anything, is some little show that I directed in a, in a barn in in Cardiff. And it was, I, I was so fulfilled, we did, we did like six performances, it was amazing. Um, and I think if you keep on working and you keep on pushing, wherever you want to go, those, those goals, goals are achievable, with or without an agent. Because if you're creating work and you need an agent, they'll, they'll, come, and see you, they'll come and see you in it. You know, and it's about building up a reputation with inside a, a community and inside an artistic community. For me, Going to drama school later was right because I think if I'd gone any younger, I wouldn't have been able to handle it. I wouldn't have been able to really take on board what was there. I think the drama school worked for me. For other people, it doesn't. You know, I've got friends who who have managed to go uh, have fantastic careers without ever stepping foot inside a drama school. And I think that as long as you're honest and truthful with yourself, constantly, you know looking at yourself and going, right, what, what, what's going on here? And you, and you follow, you follow your, your, your rhythms, I think you'll end up at the right kind of place.